invasive deadly and discovered in Indiana for first time. An invasive deadly ant has been discovered by insect experts in Indiana having ventured the farthest north it has ever been. The Asian mule ant originally evolved in Asia but was first found in the US in the 1930s since the species has gradually been spreading throughout the states. They are now found in North Carolina, Alabama, Florida, Georgia, Virginia, Virginia, Connecticut, Tennessee, and New York. However, this invasive species has now been documented in Indiana for the first time ever in the Evansville area. The Indiana Police Star reported and it could be lethal to some people. Timothy Gibb, a pure Purdue University ethnologist told the Indianapolis Star that usually stings from this ant will just hurt like crazy. However, for those who are allergic to insect stings from bees or wasps should carry an EPI pen, an auto-injectable device that delivers epinephrine with them to arm themselves against the ant. According to North Carolina State University, an Asian needle and sting is more likely to cause an allergic reaction than the venom in a honeybee sting. Gibbs said it is the first ant to be found in Indiana that has a stinger and venom sac. Currently, there are six other ant species found in Indiana. Other ants will bite, but this, but this is really new, he told the Indiana Police Star. This type of ant can also infest homes where food is present. This means there is like a argument of people being stung in infested areas. A species in it is invasive when it thrives in an environment. It is not native to and has the potential to cause harm to the ecosystems in the air, in an area. While their colonies are not as large as some ants. The Asian needle ant can live nearly anywhere because they can thrive in many environments. They can live in forested areas. They can live in forested areas, nesting under rocks and leaves, or they can live in urban na- neighborhoods. They have been found nesting under doormats and in plant pots. The ant species also have a varied diet. It eats termites, but it also digest to other ants and human trash. Keep told the Indiana Police Star that because the ant can infest homes, that will increase its ability to survive in Indiana's cold winter temperatures. It also increases the probability of it moving with people. He chicken, he said. Gibbs said people in the state should not panic, but they need to be aware of the risks the ant will introduce. Despite it being lethal to some North Carolina State University, said this ant does the greatest harm to the ecosystems it invades, and maintain vital roles in maintaining their native ecosystems. Ants can turn and aerate soil, which allows oxygen to reach the roots of plants. However, this invasive species will personally ex- exclude the native ant species in the state by eating them or their food. The invasive ant may also take over nest sites, driving out the native ants.